Hey what's up the guys, it's Brett Burns, I'm going to show you guys the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Vengeance trailer. My first impressions of it, I think it's going to be similar how Uprising was. I mean the maps were okay, but not like the greatest. I mean Cove, that's either going to be hit or miss. I think the flank routes and everyone wants to go in the middle like how Turbon was. I think it's going to be similar like that or maybe Jungle. Rush, I don't know how this is going to play. It seems like there's going to be a lot of head glitching, maybe how Nuketown or Dome and MW3. I don't know how it's going to play. Detour. It's, it's gonna remind me of a uh, hijack because it's like upstairs and downstairs and a bunch of flank routes So maybe it's like it plays like hijacked a blink uh, It's definitely gonna be my, my favorite because it's summit or unblink. I mean that's gonna be my favorite buried I'll play a bunch of times and the ray gun. I'll see how it plays So that's my first impressions of it and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this trailer Hope you guys have a good night a new video probably either be Thursday or Friday Their advantage are gonna be able to flank and master the map and really surprise enemies from behind and the side it's gonna be a lot of fun. Detour is one of my favorite head-to-head -head map collisions. You got multi-levels of this bridge, so while players are colliding on top, the battle is facing off underneath all of them. This map offers a variety of engagements. So you can be on the top of the bridge where there's medium, long, and short range. Underneath, it's more short, it's quick flanks, maybe take a shotgun or SMG. Players will create their battle lines, protect their side of the bridge, and the team that can do that successfully is the team that will win Detour. Rush is gonna take you to a paintball arena. What's paintball like in the Call of Duty universe? Well, that's Rush. There are all sorts of different environments for playing paintball, and Rush supports multiple of those environments. I love the speedball area. Move forward, use the bags. They're all different shapes. You can use them to your advantage. It's really interesting to fight in and around them. Rush is all about fast-paced action. The name is no lie. This map is all about running forward. Don't look back. You've got to press forward. Uplink is a satellite control facility in Myanmar. If you know Summit from Black Ops, then you know Uplink. So let's bring it back but give it a little twist, give it a little spice. There's a lot of good chokes. Everyone wants to hold down the main facility and that's where you're gonna hold it. That's where you're gonna have a lot of battles. And then if players wanna branch off from there and kind of flank and be smart, they have the opportunity to get in those longer range, medium or short engagements, depending on how they wanna play the map. You will stay forever. Buried is our new zombies map. This is something we've never done before. We've taken that little old west town and shoved it underground. Our four characters are back, and they have a lot more information to give the players as far as the story goes. Fans are going to be very excited about one of our new characters. It's really up to the players to find out whether or not this is something they're going to have to fight or how they can utilize them to their benefit. We're going to bring the fans the Raygun Mark II. This is an evolution of the fan favorite, the Raygun. It is a true laser gun. It is going to go through entire trains of zombies. Vengeance addresses the community desire to have head-to-head, -head, super controlled gameplay that's pushing you and the players who have the skill are the ones who are gonna come out on top of those battles. We're coming back with a vengeance on July 2nd, first on Xbox Live. Trouble in here, trouble in here. Come on, I do. Execute the traitor. Oh, I got you.